you guys, it's Ella and today I'm doing a Q&A video for you because, well, I don't I don't really know why. Um, today's video was originally going to be a Lush collection video because a lot of you had requested that after my what I got for my 16th birthday, but I filmed it and I was watching the footage and it was literally like a good 22 minutes of me just showing you soaps and bath bombs and I just thought it was so boring and I was like, I, I can't do this. I, I literally, I don't want to make my subscribers suffer if they had to watch this whole thing. So yeah, we're doing a Q&A instead because I haven't done one in a long time and because you guys had some really interesting and fun questions. So I thought I would answer them and you could know me a little bit better. Sounds good because it sounds good to me. And there's an ant crawling across my floor right now and I'm not a fan. I am not a fan. I just hit it with my slipper on the first try and it is dead. It is so very dead. Let's get started, shall we? Oh yeah, by the way back there, if you can see that, that is like a little like mannequin head thing. Um, I did like a class, or not like a class, but I had like a two week training course on like how to do hair and yeah, I, I, I have that now so it just kind of, it's in my closet but it's like rolling out of my closet because my life is a mess. <laughs> so yeah, if you see the head back there, don't worry. The first question I'm going to answer is, if you could have any talent in the world, what would it be? And I think that if I could have one specific talent, I wish that I could um, dance ballet or like be a ballerina because I go to an art school and there's like different majors and I major in visual art, which is so like, well, to me it's kind of boring because like you just kind of sit there and we do a lot of drawing and like painting. But like I see like all of the performing art stuff and I see like the dancers and they'll just like dance down the hallway or like do a split or like I don't know do something really cool and I just like wow I wish I could do that so yeah, I wish I could dance and I wish I had rhythm <clears throat> and I wish I could be a ballerina so a lot of people ask me what my favorite clothing piece is right now and I literally like kind of hate my wardrobe right now I'm trying to like revamp it but I recently went on a huge shopping spree for bikinis because I'm going to Arizona soon and it's so hot there and I literally had maybe two bikinis and they were both so gross they were from like seventh grade and they're from like Aeropostale which is nasty so I got four new bathing suits the first one is from AliExpress because I wanted like a triangle dupe bikini and if you want like a review or a video all about where to buy um, duplicate like triangle bikinis for really good prices, I can do that. But this is the top that I got. I got the mesh like color block one and this was literally I think $14 um, with free shipping which is insanely good. And these are the bottoms and I think they're so cute together. They just look like a little like I don't even know like they're just so summery. And the only bad thing about these is that they shipped like folded so there's so many like nasty creases in the back of this in the back of these bottoms and they're one size too big even though this is an extra small so it makes my butt look like a diaper but the quality is really really good and then i ordered three bikinis from bra bikinis which is also like another neoprene swimmer company and i'm wearing one of them right now it's like the um mesh one again and then these are the bottoms that came with it they're just like the orange like creamsicle ones i'm pretty sure they're called like arizona sunset which is really cool because i'm going to arizona and the other one that i ordered from brockinis is this black one it's the exact same as the triangle bikini in black and it is like it almost looks like leather but it is neoprene i guess and yeah that's from brockinis as well and these are the bottoms um once again these are like they're definitely not as cheap as 14 dollars like the aliexpress one but you are paying for way better quality faster shipping um and yeah these are these are great quality like they are exactly the same as like a triangle would be maybe even better um and then i ordered this one too which is just like the typical pink one with the pink bottoms and i have yet to wear any of these out yet because i live in boston and it is not that warm um but those are definitely my favorite clothing piece, if you count that as clothing. The next question is, if you could be on any show, what would it be? And I would definitely have to say Gossip Girl, because I know that's a really old show, but I was just in New York City last weekend, and it is one of my favorite cities of all time. Um, I might even like it more than California. I hate to say that, but it's probably true. 
Um, so yeah, if I could live, or if I could live in any city, if I could be on any TV show, I'd be in Gossip Girl because they live in New York City and their lifestyle is like my lifestyle goals. Okay, sometimes my camera does this weird thing where it just stops recording for some reason and then like it just, it just stops and I don't know why. The next question is, what is your favorite store to shop at? And currently right now it's Brandy Melville, which I'm probably sounds so biased because I work there. But all of our clothes are just so comfy and so cute. We've gotten so many cute things for the summer, like overalls and shorts and cute little crop tops, which are so cute. But I'm also trying to kind of dress... Oh, I'm also kind of trying to dress like a little bit edgier because like I want to like have my style game be comfy but also really like cute and edgy. Like I look like a fashion blogger all the time, which would be really cool. So yeah, I kind of like Zara for that kind of look and then Brandy for like the more comfy look and then I kind of try and morph the two together to be like this cute and comfy look where I kind of just look, how many times can I say look? I don't know. But I want to look like a fashion blogger at all times because they are the real goals in life. The next question is, do you have any book recommendations? And I was also asked if I liked reading, which yes, I love reading. I've been really busy re like in the past few months so I've kind of taken a break from it but I've recently gotten way back into it and I just finished the book so I just finished the book to all the boys I've loved before I got this at my school library because it looked really good and I've heard good things about it and I just finished it it took me about two weeks to read which is not too shabby considering it's a pretty dense book but at first I was like this is such a typical teenage girl book but towards the end, I was like, oh my god, I'm so in love with this book. It's so good. So yeah, this is To All the Boys I've Loved Before by Jenny Han. I'd recommend it to any girl around my age because it's so relatable and it's basically just typical, like, girl problems, just girly things. Am I right, ladies? My friend Kara asked, when will I have another giveaway? Which is so funny because I just finished up with my bathing suit giveaway. So congratulations to Lily, the winner of that giveaway. Um, I'm probably going to be doing another giveaway soon because I really want to do one. I love giving back to you guys and I'm probably going to start collecting prizes now and then yeah so if there's anything you guys want to win that's probably like within the price range of like 20 to like $150 um, I can probably start collecting prizes now and do a giveaway soon. Shake Shack or Taco Bell? Um... There's someone in my house and I don't know who it is. Um, I'd have to say probably Shake Shack because Taco Bell gives me stomach aches like all the time. But I heard that they're coming back with the Beefy Crunch Burrito, which is like the burrito with the f like Flaming Hot Fritos in it, which is my all-time favorite. So if they come back with that, it might be my favorite. What is the weather and temperature like where you are right now? And I am currently in Boston, Massachusetts. Um, it's pretty great. Um, I don't know why people hate it so much. It's pretty fun. I mean, it's not like the biggest city, but it's pretty cute. And um, the weather right now is 81 degrees outside, which is really nice. I might have to go outside and tan while I do my homework because I'm very pale. And yeah, it's pretty great. So many of you guys asked what my favorite song is right now or my favorite music genre. And that is so hard to say because my music taste is always varying. But you can always check out my Spotify because I like make a new playlist every season. And I'm currently working on a playlist called Warmer Weather, which is so great. There's a ton of different kinds of music on there. There's like indie music, pop music, like R&B and hip hop music. Um, and yeah, I know every YouTuber says this, but I've been loving Kehlani recently. She is great. Her songs are literally so relatable. If there's one place that you can move to, what would it be? And this is so hard to decide, but... I think I'd move to Paris because there's such great style in Paris and it's just like very like chic but laid back in a way and I just want to like live in an apartment in Paris and sit on my balcony with a pretty view of like the city area and just drink like coffee and read a book and look cute. I got a question that says how was prom and if you didn't know I went to prom last night I'm pretty sure I said that in the beginning of this video. Um, it definitely was not the best experience of my life. Um, it was n not at all what I was expecting it to be. Like, nothing like the movies, nothing like anyone has ever said to me before. Literally, we were in one of the, like, conference rooms, or not conference rooms, like, an event room of a 
hotel in like outside of Boston because my I go to public school so we don't have money like at all so we could not afford like to go somewhere nice and there were barely any decorations there were just like tables with tablecloths and like a few like fairy lights around the room um they literally played maybe four songs in English so yeah that was very diverse of them very nice you know literally every single song was in Spanish um yeah everyone looked really nice that was really cute took some cute pictures with my friends but yeah that was that was my prom it was an it was it was a night to remember so yeah that is everything i'm going to answer for today i hope that you guys enjoyed this video Please make sure to give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and subscribe if you are new here. Um, but yeah, that is it for today. I love you all so much and I hope to see you when I upload my next video. Bye guys.